So Microsoft released their developer preview of Windows 8.1, um, which has a lot of features that a, a lot of people are really excited about and they think it makes Windows more mature uh, and able to compete with the other operating systems, et cetera, et cetera. Well, that has yet to be seen. Um, you can, in fact, download and install the developer edition of Windows 8.1 right now and try it for yourself. Quick disclaimer, if you do, you can't easily go back to Windows Phone 8. Um, there might be a way to do it with a stock ROM and flashing that, um, but there's no guarantee that there is one for your specific device, and there's no guarantee that you'll even find it if there was. So with that in mind, if you do want to try this out, please be prepared uh, to kind of be stuck with it. Um, but I've been using it for a little bit, and it works pretty well, so that's up to you. Um, but in this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install the Windows Phone 8.1 developer preview on your Windows Phone 8 device. Okay, before you begin, um, if you do this, you cannot easily downgrade back to Windows Phone 8. Um, there are some rumors that you can do it with using a stock ROM and flashing that and all that fun stuff, but it's not easy to do and it's, there's no guarantee that there's one for your device either. So just understand that doing this, you're probably going to be stuck on 8.1. Fair warning. Next, uh, you're going to go to appsudo.windowsphone.com. Hit start new project in the top right. and put in your Microsoft account. If you don't have one, you have to register for one, and then just start with some type of project. And so long as you have one open, we can then go to the next step. Okay, then on your device, you're gonna go to the store, go to apps, search, for preview for developers, tap on that, and then tap install, hit accept, and wait for that to install. Okay, once it installs, uh, you're just going to keep hitting next and accept, and then you have to sign in with your Microsoft account. Hit enable, hit done, done. And we're gonna go to settings. We're gonna go to, oops, phone update. Check for updates. Eventually you'll get um, that your update is ready to be installed. Um, and it's, you'll notice it's not actually 8.1, it's like a stepping stone between the two. So you're going to tap install, the device will restart and install that. Okay, eventually will say that that update is done and says that you're ready for 8.1. So we're then going to go back to settings and back to phone update and check for an update one more time. Eventually it will tell you that you're ready to go to 8.1. Uh, and that this will take 15 to 30 minutes and could take longer. So just keep that in mind and tap install. Hit install again, install again, and wait for it to restart. And eventually it will say the update was successful. You click continue and go through all of the new features. Enjoy. And there you go. Now you have the Windows 8.1 developer preview and you can play with all those new features. Uh, etc. If you do want Cortana, which is their version of Siri or Google Now, um, you just have to go into the settings to change your region to the United States and then change your language to English to the United States um, to be able to use it, obviously, if you're not already there and that is already what your region is. Um, but there you go, and then you can play with that as well and test all of those features out. Um, I will be doing another video on Windows uh, Phone 8.1, basically just going through all of the neat features that they have, the changes that they've made, um, and kind of just doing a little sort of a review, but not really, uh, more of a walkthrough. And um, so you can expect that soon. And uh, as always, please feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel, um, Twitter, Facebook, Google+, and thanks for watching.